welcome back, and today we're going to be going over all 15 OLL cases with this edge center edge line. Line cases are pretty common, occurring 25% of the time, so these algorithms will be pretty helpful to your solves. First, let's go over both cases that form a T on the top. One of these has bars of 2 on the sides, and then this one just has headlights. So for this one, you would hold this side of the T here and perform this algorithm. F r, u, r prime, u prime, f prime. For this one, you would hold the t in the same way, but you would do this algorithm. r, u, r prime, u prime, r prime, f, r, f prime. Now for the two cases that make a letter C. So notice the difference. This one has a bar of three here, while this one just has two blinkers. So for the bar of 3, you would hold up the cube like this, and then do this algorithm. R prime, U prime, R prime, F, R, F prime, U, R. For the other case, when you don't have a nice bar of 3, you would hold these two corners in front of you, and then do this algorithm. R, U, R2, U prime, R prime, F, R, U, R, U prime, F prime. These cases make a Z and an S. They're also called light bolts. For both cases, you'll hold this side towards you that has no yellows touching each other, not this side, which has this yellow bar. So for this case, you will hold the side towards you and do this algorithm. R prime, F, R, U, R prime, U prime, F prime, U, R. For this case, you'll do the exact mirror of it, but I'll, I'll also say the algorithm. L, F prime, L prime, U prime, L, U, F, U prime, L prime. Here's the line algorithm for when all corners are already oriented. So you'll hold it with the two that need to flip vertically and do this algorithm. R, U, R prime, U prime, M prime, U, R, U prime, R wide prime. These next four cases have no corners facing up, so let's go over the differences between them. This first one is the only one with blocks of two, so it's pretty easy to spot. You'll hold this block of two here and do this algorithm. F wide. R, U, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, U prime, F, Y prime. This case has two blocks of three. You'll hold this vertically and then do this algorithm. R, U2, R2, U prime, R, U prime, R prime, U2, F, R, F prime. That was sort of similar to when you have corners facing out here and headlights here. This case has a bar of three, as well as this broken bar with blinkers. So you'll hold the broken bar here and then do this algorithm. R, U, R prime, U, R, then Y, U prime, R, U prime, R prime, F prime. This so last case is when you have jumbled pieces here and jumbled pieces here. So hold to this horizontally and then do this algorithm. F, R, U, R prime, U prime, R, F prime, R wide, U, R prime, U prime, R wide prime. These last four cases all have this L block and are very similar. These are probably the hardest ones to recognize, but let's go over the differences now. So first, let's go over these two. Notice how these two have blocks of two in the front, as well as blocks of two in the back. Also, one has a dot on the right, while one has a dot on the left. Let's go over this one first. So holding the cube like this, you'll do this algorithm. R prime, F, R, U, R prime, F prime, R, then F, U prime, F prime. 
for that last one, I normally sort of do a cube turn and go like that just to put the F2L pair in, but you can do it however you want. For this one, you'll do a different algorithm, even though it looks similar. So, R wide, U prime, R wide prime, U prime, R wide, U, R wide prime. Then F prime, U, F. Also, I sort of just go like this for that last F2L pair. These other two cases look similar, but they are different. So notice that we have blocks of two here, but then no two yellow pieces touching each other on this side. So if when you hold it, the dot is on the right here, then you'll do this algorithm. R wide, U, R wide prime, R, U, R prime, U prime, R wide, U prime, R wide prime. And then you'll essentially just mirror that algorithm to do it for this one. So you'll do L wide prime, U prime, L wide, L prime, U prime, L, U, L wide prime, U, L wide. Remember that reaction time is key to one look OLL, so before you move to the next set of algorithms, make sure that you can easily recognize all 15 of these. If you plan on learning full OLL, I have a playlist with every single OLL algorithm in my channel. I hope this video helped you, and for the future, good luck.